Why do I even play this game? That is the question I ask myself every time I boot it up. Is it because of the impeccable texture work? Probably not. Well, how about the photo mode? Uh, maybe? Okay, Fallout 76 is, to this day, such a mess in terms of the game's stability and visual fidelity. Like, seriously, it sometimes feels like I'm playing a PS2 game. But the photo mode is actually really cool and does something I've not seen other games do in that it uses photo mode as a source of progression. Fallout does this in two ways. Firstly, there are unlockable frames and poses within the mode. These can be obtained through quests or the free battle pass they have. This is a really cool idea and I wish more games would lean into the photo mode as a tool of expression like this. The frames are great too. They range from postcards to military propaganda. Now, the second way the photo mode ties into progression is that there are often daily challenges that ask the player to take photos. Now, granted, most of the time the photo is of literally anything, so you could just open up your menu and spam a photo mode three times to complete the challenge. But there are others that ask the player to take a specific photo of something or someone. This is awesome. I love the idea of gamifying photo mode in a way that encourages the player to explore the world in different ways. It would also be cool to see this expanded and somehow allow players to frame their photos and put them inside their player-made homes. Another noteworthy addition to Fallout 76 is the variety in player housing. One might explore the entire map, but every time you log on there are new and fascinating player structures that give the game a, a kind of longevity to it. Now, on to the not-so-favorable stuff. Firstly, I don't think Bethesda understands what brightness means. When you move the brightness slider even an inch, the whole screen just starts to blow out the whites. The brightness value of an image affects all tones equally, so we should be seeing the black levels rise as well as the whites. This is just not the case. The entire image is just overexposed, and it's honestly, it just ruins the image. Additionally, the visual fidelity in Fallout 76 is horrendous. Forget about taking close-up shots, because all you're gonna get is a muddy pile of shit in front of you. The textures are wildly bad. I, I even recently went back to look at older Fallout games just to compare, and they were all better looking. Look at this shot from Fallout 3. Now, the geometry isn't perfect, but at least the textures have clarity. Fallout 76 has a lot of ideas that would be great additions to other live service games. But a lot of these ideas go to waste when the world itself isn't worth capturing. When you offer a photo mode in a game, there needs to be a confidence behind the fidelity and style of your game. Fallout 76 lacks fidelity in a major way, and it suffers for it. 